would like to share a video on the photolysis of water. So from this video you will be able to understand uh, what is a photolysis of water, then uh, what are the uh, site or what is the occurrence, where, the, where does it occur of photolysis of water. Next, what kind of cofactors are essential uh, to uh, continue the process of photolysis of water uh, along with that. What is the main use or benefit from the photolysis of water? So let's start. The photolysis of water, it is also called as a photo oxidation of water and from that process molecular oxygen uh, can get uh, liberated from the human region. So and the photolysis of water, lysis means what? Simply the lysis means breakdown okay uh, of water the breakdown of water by using the photon photon means light energy okay the uh, light into uh, proton electron and oxygen so the, that is a called as a photolysis of water so the photolysis of water what is the site the site is the lumen okay uh, the th in the thylakoid membrane there is a photosystem PS1 and PS2 and next to the thylakoid membrane means inner uh, side of the thylakoid membrane there is a part of a lumen okay and in that the photolysis of water takes place so uh, it begins with the process of photosynthesis okay so basically the photosynthesis means what uh, by using the light energy uh, it get converted into the chemical energy to produce their own food material that is a sugar okay so in the light re uh, the photosynthesis comprises light and dark reaction the light light reaction produces high energy molecule and dark reaction it is used for the producing the sugar okay for their own food material so the photosynthesis comprises light and dark in the light reaction there are actually photosystems which harvest the light energy okay at a particular wavelength so the uh, light reaction comprises the photosystem ps1 and ps2 so the uh, actually where does it occur okay uh, the photolysis of water it occurs with the uh, uh, process of uh, in the process of photosystem 2 uh, which uh, harvest the light at P, uh, 680 nanometer okay with the help of accessory pigment so we will see what is the actual reactions are happening in the photolysis of water let's see now when the accessory pigments accessory pigments means anthophil, keratonites, phycobilins okay these are the uh, B, C, D, E these are the accessory pigment which harvest the light energy from the sun okay uh, it this light energy transfer to the photosystem 2 and photosystem 2 it has the reaction center that is a chlorophyll a molecule along with the it has an electron hole okay and uh, when it uh, transfer the light energy to the photosystem that is a, to the reaction center the reaction center it gets excited from the ground state to the higher state and it releases the heat and the uh, it transfers the electron to the Q that is a fuel piping that is a primary electron acceptor okay and it uh, transfers the electron and the high energy molecule uh, produced with the help of uh, PS2 that is a photosystem 2 and the uh, photosystem first so uh, now question will come into mind as what is the uh, electron source the electron source is nothing but the photolysis of water and from that reaction the ps2 gets the electron so uh, when the uh, light is absorbed by the accessory pigment there is a, a, a oxidation of water takes place in the uh, lumen region and these oxidation of water uh, it is uh, due to the cofactors which are present in the lumen that is a manganese calcium chlorine and these are present in the lumen which oxidize the water and it creates the stages okay it creates the stages it denotes as a s okay s0 to s4 there are two stages in s0 to s1 this is, uh, uh, it transfer one electron and the donor of electron from the lumen to the ps2 uh, it is done uh, with the help of the z, z factor so 
S zero to S one, it donates one electron to the P S two. S one to S S one to S two, it donates another. S two to S three, it donates another. And S three to S four, it transfer the last electron to the P S two with the help of the Z factor. And it it transfer to the P P six eighty. That's a photo system too. And lastly, when the it jumps or it excites. Because of the it gets the high energy to the reaction center, then the electron excited by the Q factor. So Q is the nothing but the free fighting. That is the primary electron excitor. So it is a called as a MZP six eighty Q complex. Okay. So uh, I hope uh, photolysis of water is clear to all basic concepts regarding to you and. Uh, I forget to mention here the benefit is a uh, benefit of the photolysis of water means it uh, it donates the electron to the photosystem along with it uh, uh, we get the molecular oxygen on the earth so it is a major and biggest advantage of having the photolysis of water so thanks for watching do comment and subscribe our channel.